Hi, um, this is April the 25th, 2013, and uh, we live in Saskatchewan, Canada. It is the coldest spring of uh, in a century. Still have snow at the end of April. Um, sorry. So, I started this about my Back to Eden Garden, documenting it. I'm not sure if it's going to be just for me yet, or if I'm going to post it on YouTube or something. Um, so I'll start by kind of talking about my garden. I usually do a garden. I love gardening. Um, I love all the fresh produce. Not such a fan of the weeding, that kind of thing. But, I mean, who is? Um, so with this Back to Eden, weeding is supposed to be minimal and super easy, so I'm excited about that. Um, in, I saw the Back to Eden film uh, probably August, I think it was, uh, 2012. And luckily before it was too late to get it going, before it snowed. And I thought... I really like to try this. It looks like it could be good, so I'm hoping that it's as good as the video shows. Um, I so I cleared out all the dead stuff after my gardening year. It wasn't a very, it was an okay gardening year. Um, I had a baby, so I got a bit lazy at the end uh, in August, so couldn't really. I didn't want to keep up with it. <laughs> Carrots did well. You just leave them and pull them up. That was easy. So anyway, after we got all our stuff dug up. Um, we got, my in-laws live on an acreage and their neighbors have horses, so I was able to get truckloads of manure, so I spread out newspaper, three or four layers thick, um, and then we put um, the manure on, and then I have a couple friends, one uh, trims trees and chips them, the other guy works for a landscaping company, and both were able, if I needed to get some, the wood chips from them, so I got those for free as well, um, which was great. And so it, we spread the manure, got the wood chips, spread the wood chips, and then it snowed the ap day after we put the wood chips on. So I was glad that we got that taken care of. I wanted it to kind of sit over winter, um, decompose a little bit maybe. So I'm just going to head outside and just show you what my whoops, garden is starting to look like. live in a small town here, so... Still lots of snow. Hopefully this is getting it. A little dirt there. It's a really small garden. Snow in my yard. <laughs> my compost I'm starting, so hopefully that melts soon. It's nice out today. Almost 10 degrees. That's like a first for the, for the spring. Ugh, yuck. Let's go back in here. Alright, so I will probably take videos once it uh, the snow melts and I'll uh, kind of update probably then and get kind of things sorted out and see how it goes. I'm kind of excited to try it out and I'm hoping things grow really um, produce well because so far since we've we've lived in this house for three years I think I've had this will be my third summer uh, that I will plant a garden and it's not done that great. I've never been impressed. My tomatoes just don't produce and they don't don't get very big or very many and uh, blight, I had blight one year in my tomatoes so that's probably why they didn't do good the first year I think. Um, before we had a house I planted a garden out of my in-laws and I loved it. Like it did fantastic out there and I don't, I don't know why it's never done as good as it has when I gardened out there. So I'm, anyway, I'm hoping that this Back to Eden Garden uh, it does the trick for me. We'll see how that goes. I'm really excited to get starting and get, oh boy, get started. And I gotta pick seeds up still, uh, just totally decide what seeds I want. I'm not gonna do the, the heirloom seeds. Um, I just think I waited too long to look into it. I, there's some internet sites I thought that I could get it off of, but... Um, I want to kind of just get, see how the garden goes before I start going hardcore into it like that. But uh, I'm just going to buy seeds at the grocery store, and probably, well, not the grocery store, but a, a plant store, wherever. And um, I'm really excited to get started. I usually do like carrots, uh, green beans, peas, uh, zucchini, cucumbers, tomatoes, which I'm hoping will actually thrive this year. Uh, I'm not sure what else I'll do. Uh, oh, spinach and lettuce I always do, and I'll probably do kale this year. Um, 
I did kale one year and it actually did great and I loved it and um, last year I just didn't um, get to it but uh, sometimes some peas as well though so my husband loves the peas where you can eat the pot as well so we'll see and I'm hoping this is my best gardening year yet and I'll keep I'll keep updating thanks bye